Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to change Facebook video notifications. That's right. For the last four weeks, I've been going over how-to videos for Facebook. So I decided I'll do another one because I'm on a roll. I'm going to show you how to change Facebook notifications on your um, Facebook website. I will also show you on the app, but I'll do that in a different video. This one's to show you how to do it on Facebook.com using my Windows laptop is how I'm showing it. So... But before we get going, hit the like on this video. It really helps out our channel. Also, hit the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss any new videos that come out with every Thursday. That's right, every Thursday. Make sure you always check back. All right, so let me show you how this works. So we're going to jump into our Facebook account. So make sure you sign into your Facebook account if you're not already signed in. Once you're on here, you're going to look to the... Once you're on the homepage, so you sign in, you're on the homepage. Look to the left menu. And then right here, it has your name at the top, usually your profile name. And then you're going to go all the way down till you get to videos. And we're going to click on video. And then once you do, you're on the video page now. We're going to keep looking to the left side. And at the very top where it says video, you're going to look to the right of that. And you're looking for the settings gear icon. And that's what we're looking for. We're going to click on that right here. Okay, once we do that, it's going to give you a notification settings. You can manage how you're notified about updates to video. So... You can do that right here. It shows you to show notification dot. You can turn off the dot if you don't want to see the dot. So you no longer see notification dot for watch, which I'm going to leave it on because I like knowing when someone does a new one. So it shows the notification dot. But then there's more to it. So you can go to custom notifications. So if you click on that, it's going to pull up the video notification window. Very simple here. Now, if you want to shut it all off, you can just do it at the top here. It says allow video notifications, control all notifications for videos. You can turn that off and it shuts everything off. So I'm not going to do that in the video because here I'll watch. Oh, I will watch. I'll show you. I'll do it. So there, it turns them all off. But when you turn it back on, you have to go back down and turn them all back on. So just FY. <laughs> Let's give you a warning on that one. And then right down below that, you have page notifications. This is new videos. Get notified when pages you follow post new videos. So you can turn that on or off just like we did by clicking on this and turning it back on and off. And then right below is manage pages you follow. We'll go come back to that because there's more details to that one. So we're going to go down to this one called videos. Saved videos. Get notified about videos you, you saved. So if there's anything different about them or something happens, I don't know how that really works. But they're going to notify you about that. And the last one on this list is suggestions. What's trending? Get notified about trending Video. So this is videos you probably don't follow or whatever, but it's they're trending videos now, so they'll give you an update on that. Um, so that's one of the things you can turn on and off. Those are the easy parts about turning on and off or totally turning everything off. But here, let's go to manage pages you follow. So if you want to do a little more editing, <laughs> you can do this. This is the video of notifications. You can search for pages you follow here by clicking in the search box and typing the name. If you have a lot of pages you follow, um, then... You can do it. You can search them by alphabetical, recently liked first. So they'll be first. So or earliest liked, that'll be first on the list. I usually live, leave it on alphabetical. That's pretty quick. But let's say we want to scroll down a little bit. Let's go with, uh, let's go with this one right here. Okay. So let's say you want to change this. So you have this one right here. This you find the page or what you're following. You look to the right and it says right now it's doing highlights. So if you click this box, it lets you change it. So you can say all you get notifications for all the videos that this page puts out, or you can just do it. the highlights like I have it set up, or you can do none. So now let me show you what happens when you do this. This is the kind of trick me in the beginning. So you click this, say none. Notice how it blinked and didn't do anything. Well, I'll go to the page and I'll show you it actually worked. And as you can see, if I get out of this, it actually shows it not doing it. So if you click on that little underneath their profile picture, under the bell icon, you're going to see it's already ch changed. So I don't know why it doesn't do that when you're inside the settings, but it doesn't. So that's what's going on. So you can change it back to highlights. That's what I'm doing. So I'm going to go back to the settings so I can show you. This is the settings. And you can go back in here and you can do it to any one of these. So if you click on this, you can say you don't want to have notification for none of them or you want highlights only or you want every video they put out, they're, they're going to send you a notification. So that's how you can control the notifications, change your uh, video notifications on your Facebook account using the website. It's very easy. Go in here and mess around with it. It's pretty fun. I mean, it's nice to know that I don't always want to hear everybody's videos, 
but this is the way you do it on um, the website itself. I'll make another video later on about how to do it on the app, but right now, this is how you do it this way. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com. That's where all our articles are, and also make sure you subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.